Alright, Shalom, Shalom, Akiam, Yahweh Ba'asham, Yahweh Shai, Ba'asham, Racha, Kwadash, Barakatam. Alright, I want to give all praises to Yahweh Yahweh Shai. Double honor to the apostles of Great Millstone. This year is Amma 1 from the Great Millstone Camp in Trinidad. Coming to do another lesson through the Holy Spirit and the power of Yahweh Ba'asham, Yahweh Shai. Ba'asham, Racha, Kwadash. Um, um, Basically, you know, what this this is a CNN news video, a video from CNN. Um, it was recorded when August the tenth, August the tenth, two thousand and eighteen. We in August the thirteenth, two thousand and eighteen. So you know, three days later, but hey, I just go and do a little sit down on it now. Hey. So I'll play it. Nazi in Pennsylvania, a small rural town near the New York border, splitting apart by a growing movement filled with hate. The man at the center of it says Trump's election has emboldened him and his followers. It comes as white nationalists prepare to take to the streets this weekend, one year after the deadly Charlottesville rally. Our Sarah Seidner is out front in Ulysses, Pennsylvania. I want to run in Ulysses, Pennsylvania. I want to warn you, though, when you watch this piece, some of the language that you will hear is extremely disturbing. In the calm of this rural northern Pennsylvania town, a sign that hate lives here. Are you a neo-Nazi? Do I embrace it? Um, I, I don't try to push it away. Well, you're wearing a swastika on your shirt. Exactly. And you've got swastika flags. Why the flags? Why the shirt? Why these hateful symbols in this town? I don't think they're hateful. I think it's an ideology that has been completely... Uh, Misinterpreted since the Third Reich. Okay, now I've got to stop. Like, I, I'm misinterpreted. <laughs> misinterpreted. Six million no, Jews no. were killed. You'll never there sell me on that. Abs I'm not. Lies. Yeah, hey, if you do a sen um <laughs> a record history in 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 um nineteen in the nineteen thirties, if I'm mistaken, and after nineteen forty five. Is around the same amount of population of Jews that it had. That that is a fact. If I'm mistaken, I do it already. But and them is not the real Jews anyhow. But let me play the video. Fuck, I see. Trying to sell you yeah. it is reality. It's history. It cannot be denied. Daniel Burnside is a lightning rod of discord in Ulysses, Pennsylvania. Population six ninety. With the help of the internet, his message has spread far and wide giving his town attention it does not want. The rural America spoke up when they elected Trump. Rural America. And by rural America, he means white America. We're staring down the barrel of a gun here in white America. There's still 193 million white Americans. Yes, the vast majority of them are in their 60s and 70s, will be in the ground in the next 20 years, and therefore we have the possibility of becoming a minority in our own country. A possibility. It sounds to me... Of becoming a minority in our like own country. Like you're afraid of being me. And being me, no. <laughs> no. <laughs> the point is, you so-called white people are the minority, whether you want to believe it or not. Most people on the earth have complex uh, melanin. Melanin are uh, actually melanated. Um, the statement that he made is that um, it's, it's their country, which is a lie. All right, because when you go back to you know, go back to, to because you white people, if all they know, all they really stem from Canaan. All they really stem from Canaan. If all they know, all they um in the Bible there's some called reincarnation. And Cain is all their descendant, the one who killed his own brother, um Jacob. Not his own brother Jacob, his own brother Abel, Cain, that man. That is your father, before Esau. In other words, Cain, and then when Ole killed Abel, the flood came and whatnot after the, after the killing of Abel, life go on, Noah came on the scene, the flood came, this is just a briefing, and after the flood, Cain, that spirit that was in Cain, came back as Esau, and this is what the Mosai said to Cain, and since from Cain it will follow Cain again, which is Esau in the reincarnation. Hopefully I'm making sense and you're following me. All right, so this is what I say here, right? 
Genesis 4 and 11. And now art thou cursed from the earth, which had opened her mouth to receive thy brother's blood from thy hand. When thou tillest the ground, it shall not henceforth yield unto thee her strength. A fugitive and a vagabond shall thou be in the earth. And that is these so-called white people. They are fugitives and vagabonds. That land, you go back 500 plus years ago, the face of a, uh, the face of that land would have be a, a so-called Gadite or a Reubenite, which you so-called white people or people in the earth today would call North American Indians and Seminole Indians. Or some would be Issacarites, which you people would call Mexicans. You know? Which are Hebrew Israelites according to the Bible. 500 plus years ago. Now in this time. Yeah. An actual person of that land. Would be a so called white man. Because. Of the fact that you came and you killed the people of the land. Fuck. Alright. And you, and, you, and you put them in slavery. You put. You murdered. Vast majority of them. And sent them on the reservations to live like dogs. Because why? You're looking for a place to live. You don't have a home of your own. Alright? And the home of your own, you left. Which is where? Edom. Um, yeah, Edom. Mount Seir. So, I will come in here, you are fugitive. Fugitive come from the Hebrew. Now, na, na why? Alright? Now, why? And it means to quiver, totter, shake, reel, stagger, wander, move, sift, make, move, wave, wave, or tremble. Um, to wave, quiver, vibrate, swing, stagger, and tremble, be unstable. To totter, go tottering, vagabond. Participle, to be tossed about or around. You see, you don't have a certain place, a certain dwelling place. You do, you, 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 you just a vagabond in the earth. Coming and taking the people land. That is not yours. That land wasn't yours, bro. That land belonged to the Native American Indians. That is their land. And you have so much of pride. You're saying you're not going away. No, um, vagabond come from the Hebrew. Nawad. Nawad. And it means to shake, wave, or wonder. Which is almost the same thing. Alright? To show grief, to cause to wonder. Wagging. To move oneself to and fro, sweet, totter. Same, almost the same thing. You have no, you have no, and, and that grand truly be coming into, into, um, fruition when we in the kingdom. Because after a thousand years, you're going to burn you up. You ain't going to have no land of yours. You ain't going to have no land right now. You ain't going to have no land that belongs to you. Alright? That was the most high. That is, that is your punishment. Okay? So when it, that is why when you read Habakkuk, the second chapter and the fifth verse, see here also because he transgressed by wine. This is talking about the so-called white man. He's a proud man, neither keep it at home. Because he's a vagabond. You're, 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 you're all over the place. You're just, you're not stable. You're moving to and fro, going back what? To the curse of Cain. Because you are Cain. Cain is your forefather. Alright? Cain is your, that spirit that was in Cain is the same spirit that is in you. Okay? And it says, who enlarges his desire as hell and is as death, and cannot be satisfied, but gather it unto him all nations, and heap it unto him all people. That is you, so-called white people. Okay? So, let me go back and play the video. Because you're talking about you ain't going to leave, that is your land. That is not your land. You remove your neighbor's landmark. Coming out, find them treaties, and then murdering them. Hey, and I glad all you thinking like that. No? Yeah, all you think, all you, yeah, think like that. That is the correct way for all you to be thinking. Don't think to be loving fucking me. I don't need all your love. You don't think that all you want to be dominant. 
Because that's how we thinking. We want to be dominant too. And we go see who are the greater. The man with the bigger gun go winner. We don't have no guns literally. The man, the, the man, the man, I just talking in a um, metaphoric sense. In the battle that we fighting, who have the, who stronger go win, you know, in other words. Because generally, in a gun battle, the man with the bigger gun is the stronger one, you know. The country is great. This is also my country. You guys didn't win the culture war. He invited us on his property to talk, but when he doesn't like our conversation, he explodes. Get the out of here. Now. We do. Just down the street, we're met by a dozen residents who say Burnside does not speak for this town. There are families in this county that blame politics for people like him sort of being able to come out and be very loud. Is that fair? Our president we've got right now hasn't, hasn't helped the situation a whole lot. Uh, you know, he's done a lot of the same beliefs. You know, at least he won't speak against him. Okay. This guy feeds off that stuff. Among the crowd, many with these are phone. old devil bitch. All of them is devils. The whole so-called white race is a bunch of devils. All right, small tongue blames Trump for giving neo-Nazi a voice. Yo, America was always a place of oppression for so-called black people or any other nation who ain't white, blonde hair, blue eye. All right, so-called white. They always had a voice. Fuck all, fuck all you're talking about. Trump give them a voice. They always had a voice. Jake always be, be, been being oppressed in that place. That's why the most high going ready to bring it down. That is why. Alright? The most high going ready to bring it down for a reason. Because all you oppress, all you oppress the most high people in the land. His own people in the land. Okay? And that ain't right. That ain't right. And hey, feel I go, I go um, hold it up there, hold it up there under, you know. And I wanna give all praises to Yahweh by Hashem Yahushai, by Hashem Rachakodash. And double and see the apostles are great with stone that rule well. That land is not you so-called white people on. This old devil bitch. All all your fucking devils going and going slavery. That is thus here the Lord. And as Apostle the letter has say, for some of you like to come on and say, Why are you cursing? As Apostle the letter has say, if you don't like the cursing, nobody then invite you to watch. Yes, we just say the F word. Big deal. We don't, we don't say it every two words, but sometimes it comes out. So what? So a white man fucking raping and murdering people all over the earth. Why you talk about that? Hey, hey so with that, I want to give all praises to you. I was shy. But I sham your heart on ash. And double on the apostles. These old white cracker people going on dead like this old cracker bitch on the screen here. Punishments for she. Shalawamakiam. Don Lemon, you're here in Washington.